Hello everybody and welcome to this week's episode of 2GW. We're here in Chocolate Country, Hershey, Pennsylvania. You don't have chocolate on your floors. We have pavement. Yeah, the pavement. Oh god, that's gonna hurt. Yeah, it's not very tasty. Yeah. And here he comes, the other half of the Funtime Friendship Champions. And <laughs> I talked to AJ backstage earlier and I was like, how you feeling, buddy? And he's like, nervous. I'm like, why? He's like, after what happened on Monday. Yeah, seeing his tag team partner put on the, a clinic, the, an absolute clinic, the performance of the century. He he must feel a little inadequate right now because like there is a lot of pressure on him to perform as well. Exactly. I mean, AJ is a good performer, but that but Viper's effort on Monday was out of this world. There's, AJ is the other half of the championship that Viper holds, so if they should at least be on equal footing, because it's the tag belt. It, mm. So let's see what he can do. The question is, who's he up against? Hmm. I mean, who did uh, who did the commissioner send after him this week? Yeah. We are we are now four days away from Bees and Seedings 2. It is closing in. It's closing in real fast, folks. And the matches that we have planned for that show, every title on the line, an appearance by Santa Claus. I mean, that's a given. Yeah. Every year he comes around. Yep. We are also two days away from good old Smash Bros., that we are. <clears throat> We're not sponsored by Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, unfortunately. No. Unfortunately, we are not sponsored by anything, really. AJ cracking the neck. Checking the ropes. And, oh, boy. Oh, God. Veeg. It is... Here is somebody you don't want to make bleed. Yeah. Because there was Crimson on the Crimson Dojo this past Monday. That there was. And it didn't seem to affect either man at all, really. I mean, Viper was a bloody mess, and then he head-butted the stone mask. <laughs> That's what you gotta do. You gotta assert dominance like that. But well, Veeg has proven time and time again that when he bleeds, he just gets angrier. Yeah. And that's putting it lightly. Mm. So, AJ... Better be on the strategical effort in this match instead Should of the brute force. I mean, v I mean, AJ and Vig, they have been in the ring against each other once on many occasions before. Usually fighting over that inter crosbinental championship. And there's George. There's, there's the, bell. the bell. Here, Here we, we go. go. Kicked the midsection. midsection. Right hands. Throwing the hands. Goes for the scoop. Doesn't work. Nope. It usually doesn't. There's a neck breaker. I mean, this is shoulder check. It's kind of like a cat and mouse game. I mean, look, due to the size advantage and the considerable weight advantage. Yep. AJ's just got to utilize his agility and thinking power in order and to beat this monstrous brute of a man. And V has to utilize that that power, as you just saw with that DDT. Yep. Oh, there's a headbutt. There's a headbutt. Taking a page from Marvel's book, but giving him in threes. And then there comes the third. Oh. Right off the forehead. I mean, what other part of his body is thicker than his head? His unmentionable. Oh, oh God! God! A big shoulder check right off the apron. Oh, the mount. The mount. Oh, oh he's just raining him, pummeling into him. Oh, all oh, those stiff elbows right to the forehead. That could easily bust you open, folks. It could if he's not careful. For this, oh, oh, AJ countering with the knee. Oh, to the midsection. DDT. On the, the floor. Be careful. To the hard floor. Starting off that damage early. And drop kick. Speaking of early, you guys might want to pay attention to the oh. count here, guys. We can't see what it is at, can't but see it's what it is. pretty high. There we go. Chucks him back in. Then, count had to be getting up there. I'd say it was Probably around seven. Seven or eight. Mm. Ooh. 
flexing on him. He's letting out a roar. And we'll hooks him into a back suplex. Oh. Just dropping him on his head. Chucks him back over back the to the apron. And, and then, then chucks just back throwing over. him all over the place. Oh no. Boy, he's playing back. Uppercut. Vegas has got to be getting ready for his inter Crosby-Nental Championship match against Eric James this Sunday. Whoa. I got to wonder how prepared AJ is for this. Because while Vegas and the Marble are similar in stature, they are not similar in fighting style. That they're not. And straight right hand. And whoa, God! Whoa. That big lifting reverse DDT. Vig showing off the strength. Chucks into the corner. Mm. Catches the leg. Vig is all about the brute strength. Marble, he's about the power, but like dare I say, in a bit more refined manner. Like he has a good head on his shoulders, at least. Yeah. Vig is just unstable. <laughs> Vig is just. Oh, there's a clothesline. Oh. Oh, to the, to the corner. corner. That big right. splash. Running body splash. Duck Let's under. Do another clothesline. Oh. Nice. That's what Let's AJ has this. to do. AJ has to use that. Oh, and the oh. nice flip. Nice back flip. But AJ has to use that speed. What were you saying about the marble? Oh, it's, yeah. The, the marble is like pure, unadulterated beast incarnate. Mm. As AJ hits the angle slam. He is a wild animal. And mm -hmm. when he's backed in a corner, he will... He will unleash all of his potential. That he will. The right hand. AJ in control of the match for the time being. Hooks the leg. Hook screw, or dragon, dragon screw. screw. And then and throws a knee to the, to the mat. Smart move. Going after the leg. Just wear down the mobility of the big man. Yep. Oh. 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 He's Wait. got him up. Oh, right. oh no! Oh, he's carrying, he's carrying him. him! Oh, carry oh, bomb! And he plants him. A slight delayed carry. Just showing the power, showing off that strength. There's the cover. There's the cover. One, two, two, two. and a half. Cool. Oh. has got to be shook after that one. A little bit. I mean, how can you not be? Vig, seven foot four. I mean, I don't know how Marble's jackhammer feels, but. Compared between the two, I think the Barbarian Bomb's a little bit more vicious. A little bit, because Vig is 7'4", and then he holds you up even higher. And then he just throws you down with, like, the, with the biggest amount of force. It's just raw power in the arms, bringing you down with all the force. Oh, what a nice corkscrew elbow there from AJ. Pops over to the apron. Looking for a springboard. This is risky. Whoa! Nice senton. Off the, off the ropes. ropes. Another another front flip. Right across the chest of V. And then sprinkle a moonsault into a, into cover. a cover. One, One two. two. That, was, that was very slow. I was going to say, that looked like a very bit of a slow count there by George. By George. I think he's counting. I think. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Wool setting off to the top rope. I, I hope so. Man. Be, oh, oh, God! Throwing that giant of a man off that top rope. Oh. A knee drop right to the forehead. AJ, you are treading dangerous territory here, my that friend. That he is. Like he is on thin ice, and that ice is melting by the minute. Be fighting back with the elbows to the gut. She's trying to shake the cobwebs out. And just carry him to the turnbuckle. Oh. Chucks him away. Lawbreaker counter. Whoa. Whoa. Runs in for something. V counters. Good counter. Right hand. Whoa. Goes for the snap there. I think that's what he wanted. Yep. Into an arm bar. Ooh, he's got that in. Oh, he's, he's wrenching back. back. I mean, if there's anything good about this, it can't make you bleed. Yeah. Trying to weaken the ever powerful arms of V. Not sure how good that's good. I mean, because V. 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 V has strength in spades. That he does. Whoa. Nice, nice athleticism. 
AJ tries to continue, but Iggy's on top of it. And then bring him to the ropes. AJ being smart, he's he's continuing the offense here. That's what you have to do. Trying to use Vig's own body weight against him. Goes for the scoop. V countered. Ooh, Ooh, big back, back suplex. Going to a Going cover. To cover. One, two, two, two. two. He's got to be feeling a bit fatigued here. I mean, he's he's taken a quite a bit of punishment over the past couple minutes. Mm. Oh, oh wait a minute! Chokehold! Chokehold! Oh! oh. AJ fights out! He fought out of it! And goes to oh, the slam! Oh my goodness! Can this do it? Here's There's the a cover! cover. One, One! Two! Three! And there you have it! AJ is your winner! He survived the storm! That he did! Seeing his teammate be so, like, immaculately successful... I mean, that's putting it a little strongly. Speak so I like, mean, it was, it was an immaculate performance. I will give Viper that. It's like it must have fueled his determination to perform, mm. and he picked up the win against probably one of his toughest opponents on the brand. Exactly, Dara is like Vig is probably top three stars on this brand. Yeah. An impressive win. A lot of momentum going into bees and seedings too. There are. Th there are things. Look, things are looking really good for the Frenchman squad. That it does. That it is. Words. Yeah. But. So that. But the match we have coming up next, folks. It's a doozy. And surprisingly, yeah. it's the main event for yeah. this week. It's a, little, it's a little short week this week. Because we want the talent rested up to bring their A game for bees and seedings too. That we do. And we'll be back with that in just a few moments. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to 2GW. We're here in Worcester, Massachusetts, and it's main event time. In relation to Jonathan Worcester. Yeah. <clears throat> and the ladies in the ring, because apparently the old commissioner has made an exception to his ruling that he made a couple weeks ago. How Remember how he said that there would be no titles on the line defended until B's and Seedings. That is right. But apparently, he has made one exception. Really? And that exception being this match. Because of, I mean, what we have seen like unfold between this man, Nate, and the 2GW World Champion, Aaron. I mean, just last week. That's... They beat the piss out of each other backstage. That was a vicious confrontation. That it was. So, Schluff... I mean, he's take he took his focus off those fun time friendship championships for just for a moment to basically say screw it. Nate versus Aaron, the two GW World Championship on the line here today, mm. with the winner going on to Bees and Seedings two this Sunday to defend that title against the 2018 Dumb Rumble winner Polish guy. Mm. Yeah. yeah. You gotta believe though that this is this is what Nate wants. This is what Nate wanted. Yeah, he he fought off Aaron backstage and surprisingly. He did. Twice. After a bloody battle. Let's see if he can do it again officially for the third time and actually nab that world title from him. Hmm. Aaron, the, the current two GW world champion, winning that title from Ace by cashing in the Warfenheimer. Hmm. Successfully retaining that title against Eric James several weeks ago. Coming up short against Crimson Dojo champion The Rug at the Rumble. Mm. But this is what, like, like I said, like, like I said before, it's like this is what Nate wanted. He wants to see how well he can do against Big Dog Aaron. See if he can knock him down a few pegs. I mean, just by what happened last week yeah. and two and three weeks ago, he, I think he's knocked him down a few pegs. Yeah, like he is capable. Now he just has to do it where it matters. Exactly. And to nobody's surprise, this match is no holds barred. Mm. Well, hopefully Nate remembers to utilize all of his skills and talents and everything at his disposal. And his bald head. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> See, he's got a sign. Yeah. That's not Mark Henry. I don't know what you're talking about. There's the belt. There's the belt. Nate looking surpri surprisingly focused. Very stern. 
I mean, they, a former Inter Crosby Nental champion and the resident dad man. Mm. Oh, he's, he's clenching his fist. He, he is determined as ever. And there's the world champion. It's Aaron. Also returning the star look. Yeah. And crinkling his very large nostrils. Mm. Very large nostrils. <laughs> As Careful the... it doesn't blast off on his knees. <laughs> it's like Diddy Kong's barrel jetpack. Oh. Just a nose. Just charge it up. <laughs> and Aaron, surprisingly, without hesitation, handing over that world title to George. Man, you gotta believe that these two want to fight. And well, they're going to get to in just a few seconds. And George holding up that title in front of the exit. <laughs> if you want to leave now, now's the time. I mean, it's a main event, folks. There's the, the bell. The 2GW World Championship on the line. We are underway. Whoa, God. Oh, huge hip toss. Starting it off strong. Nate. Nate using, uh -oh. using his time. Right off the bat. No hesitation. He wants every advantage he can get, but Aaron was ready for it. He was. And oh, oh God. Right oh, again, really? right off the bat. As, as apparently Nate has invisible knees. <laughs> I mean... Being a dad does things to you. <laughs> One of which removes your patellas. I mean, I mean, I, I've heard of people having bad knees, but no knees. I mean, yo, they're just that bad. <laughs> and then these two behemoths collide. Ooh, Russian leg nice sweep. sweep. That sledgehammer sits ominously just in the middle of the mat. It is within arm's reach. Oh, Ooh. Aaron countered. I mean, these two men were tag team partners just two weeks ago. Yep. Defeating the Funtime Friendship Champions. Oh, Nate with a back oh. soup. Oh, almost on that hammer. I wonder if he caught the uh, the hard point of that hammer in that drop. Hmm. Picks him up. Hasn't seemed to affect him oh, too much. God. Oh, goodness. Huge flapjack. There's one guy in the pool. Big headbutt. Head the midsection. These a lot two of men... people using their heads this week. Yeah, I mean, Ooh, stuff. Oh, big back body drop. Nate rolling to the outside. Aaron yelling something to the crowd. Couple people giving the big thumbs down in the front row. They're not a fan of the champion. Oh, goes for the scoop. Nate fighting out of it. Oh, he's, he's got the hammer. He's got the hammer. Oh. And Rips oh! it from him and jabs him right in the chest. Runs in. Nate counters. Great counter by Nate. Hooks him. Whoa. Swing neck breaker. And do. Oh, senton flip. Like a big cannonball. He's got the hammer again. Oh, and jabs oh. him right in the shoulder. He got him that time. Chucks it over the ropes. He only wanted that one good shot. Maybe that's all he needs. Maybe. Oh, but Aaron back up. Big shoulder block. Oh, but Nate right back up. Either man getting a clear advantage here. Throws the arm to the mat. Weaken the arm, you weaken the choke. Fireman's carry. Look at the strength of Nate here. And drops him right on the ropes. That dumb classic. Sets him up. That's dead weight. Whoa. Nope. Oh, Aaron countered. Suplex. Nate's leg coming off at the knee, it seems. <laughs> oh, oh, my God! God! Oh, God! He runs over George while throwing Aaron he to the corner. He just trampled George. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, oh Listen, no. Guys, guys, please, please, please. <laughs> oh, okay. God. Ooh. Listen, I'm a bit uneasy when it comes to top rope maneuvers. I mean, I would have hoped they at least reinforced him a little bit after the last two times. Oh. Aaron signaling for the end, it seems. Oh, I think he ran in for something. Nate countered. Big hip toss. Oh, wait a minute. Back. Oh, suplex. Suplex. Nate in firm control of this match. Oh, flip. He is on fire right now. Yeah, he is in a... Whoa! Oh, in a second one. Like I said, like a cannonball. He's big and black and bald. <laughs> yeah. 
I've never seen a cannonball with a beard, though. Or a dad. <laughs> dad ball. <laughs> dad ball. The dad, dad ball! Dad and ball! Or well, can dad. Can dad ball. Can dad ball. Oh, oh, oh look at that. the camel clutch. Nate just wrenching back. It's no dad ball. crab. Nope. Look at the can. Got the counters down. Well, he is prepared. He doesn't want to eat anything to... Whoa. Oh, God. Look at the strength. Powerbomb? Incredible. Oh, oh, no, a neck breaker. Nate wants this bad. That he does. As long as he can avoid that that hand. That hand. Oh, he might have this in the bag. He, he is countering basically everything that Aaron is throwing at him. Oof. Oh, knees to the... Right to the Nightwing logo. Right to the back. Take that, Nightwing. He's like, nah, man. Red Hood. <laughs> No, we don't need no dick. This is the gay shit. <laughs> Aaron ramming Nate into the turnbuckle. Oh, he's raising that hand. Oh, people give him the thumbs down. Nate needs to be careful. Hey, he oh, he oh, good counter. He has to be really careful. Oh, the big. Oh, I thought it was going to be the Aquaman punch. It was just a big running shoulder tackle. Stop in the arm. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, God. Popped him right in the jaw and a leg drop. Sitting on him. There's a cover. One. One. His hands just placed centrally on his pecs. The old dad touch. Yeah. Touch of dad. <laughs> Sounds like a DV spell. Combat. Combat. Combat roll. Snapmare. Returning the shoulder claw. Clawing that shoulder. The moisture from his hands just seeping into his pores. Ooh. It's infectious. Returning the camel clutch. Oh. Yeah, bitches. <laughs> <laughs> That's just what I want to see. Yeah, bitches right under Aaron's ass. <laughs> he fought out of it. Oh. Under the knee. Front face lock. Oh. Oh, he just shoved him. Shoves him away. Shoves him away. Oh. Goes back to that corner. Setting up the faucet. That Here faucet it is running. Here it comes. Oh. No! He blocked. He blocked it. He blocked the Aquaman punch. Oh, wait a minute. Aaron can't be happy with that. Holds the arm back. Oh. oh. Punch almost to the basically to the heart. Followed by a leg drop. He just sits on him for a bit. Stomps away at him. What's Aaron gonna do here? Oh, he almost looks lost. A little bit. He might have taken some serious head damage. Mm. I mean, Nate's, looking, Nate's looking good here, but he has got to hit that one big move to really gain that advantage. He hasn't done that yet. Yeah. Kind of try to take Nate to the corner. Snap so there. He's dead. Yeah. Oh, oh a hard shot. Right to the ear, it looked like. Nate countered into the, the midsection. Section. Oh, wait a minute! Oh, he scooped he's him! He's got him up! Daddy, Daddy Driver. Driver! In the middle of the ring! That could be it! Could be crowned a new, new world champion. champion! One! Two! No! no! Two and a half. He's so close now. He is so close! What does he have to do? He's going outside the ring and he's going under. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Looking he's for got a chair. He's got that steel chair and it's black, folks. Oh, he caught him with right it. Right to the back. And another right one. Right to the leg. Oh. Chucks it back over. He doesn't want to. To the crowd, it looked like. Doesn't want it to be used against him. Oh, wait Ooh. a minute. Inverted DDT. Ooh. Oh, he oh, countered again. He countered again. Oh, he waited for oh. the knee strike. Oh, he Oh. Counter after counter. One, two. Count of two. Count of two. That is the second attempt at the Aquaman punch thwarted. Oh. One knee. And straight to the side of the dome. That prominent bald head of Nate. Oh, he went to kick oh. him. Nate countered again. Slip of the hand. Oh, 
no, 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 no! He's got the choke! He's got the choke! Nate, fight, fight it! it. Fight it! No! no! That's it! It's over! Oh! Nate was go doing so well! He was! Oh, he God! Could've, he could have taken that whole thing! And all Aaron needs is that one choke. That one choke. Your winner. And, and still. 2GW world champion. It's Aaron. Aaron. So Aaron will go on to face the Polish guy in four days. With that, two, with that same title on the line. Hmm. That'll be, that'll be something to watch. That'll be something sure. to watch. Yep. I mean, Aaron... Dare I say, he squeaked by Nate. He was in trouble for a long time there. He was able to just squeak past Nate to, to, to retain that title. And Polish guy is on a tear. I mean, he, has, he won the Rumble. He's got a ton of momentum. So, Aaron, dude, you got to switch focus. Mm. And that'll do it for this week's episode of 2GW. Yep. Tune in in just a couple days when we start Ladies Night. Yep. Bye. Bye.